Hello guys, today in this video tutorial, we will be looking at the spinner. You can also call it the drop down list. Okay, firstly, we will start by creating a project, giving it the test 2. Next, selecting the targeting Android SDK version. Now, empty activity. Next, giving the activity a name and clicking. Finish. Now we have to open the activity too. In this, you can see a text view. We don't need this text view. We will be simply adding the spinner. Now wrap context. Wrap context. Okay, now we will give it an ID spinner. Okay, we should do it a match parent and give the layout margin left as well as Android layout margin right. So what we are going to do, whenever you will click certain item, it will toast that item. Okay. So for this we will need one string. Now what we are going to do, we are going to create an string array. Okay. String array and we will give it the name count. Now within the string array, we write the items. Okay. So I will be writing item. And now I will be giving the item name 1. Okay. Now, similarly, I have to do for next item 2 and so on. Okay. Now I will be writing here 3, 4, 5. Alright. So this is our drop down list or the items that will appear in our list. Now, I have to firstly declare a spinner. Okay, now I will give the spinner the ID that was spinner. Okay, now after you have created the spinner, we have to take an array adapter. Okay, now we have to give the care sequence. This is the array adapter that we have created. We are going to give the variable a name adapter. Okay. Equals array adapter dot create from resource. Okay. The first comment is the context get application context, comma. Second one is r dot array dot our array name that was count that we have created. And the last, the third comment is Android layout. In this, you have to select simple spinner drop down item. Okay. Or simple spinner. Okay. This is the layout type of the array adapter. Now, in the next, what we are going to do. Adapter dot set drop down view resource. Okay, now we are going to write drop down item. Okay, now the next step is to assign spinner dot set adapter the adapter that we have created. Now, what we are going to do now, we are going to add select listener set on item. Select listener this okay, and we have to implement this on item select listener. Okay, there will be two methods on item select or nothing select. We have to write on item select if parent dot get id equals equals or sniper dot get id 
then we have to give a toast dot make text get application context comma dot get item at position position dot to string we have to convert it to string plus space selected now we have to give the toast a length so we will be giving it a toast dot length short dot show now what we have to do we have to just run onto the virtual device okay so this is the virtual device in which we are going to run this okay so we see that one is selected now what we are going to do is change it to two and we will see the toast two selected three selected back to one and five selected so whenever you will click it will automatically respond to the selected item so this was all about adding the on item select listener to the, the drop down list thank you